Hi, I'm Jane Whiteman and I'm Head of Extension with Fort Innovation and I'm based in Brisbane. I've been with the company for three years and um, I applied for the position of Head of Extension and was lucky to be appointed and I've been in the position now for just over 12 months. Three years ago, I came back to horticulture with Hort Innovation as a relationship manager for the vegetable industry, which I really enjoyed. Um, a couple of years ago, the, um, the company's strategic investment plan was developed and there was a lot of feedback uh, from industry about um, wanting, wanting the company to be um, more regionally focused and understand regional needs and, um, and be closer to, to grow as an industry. And um, Matt Brand, our CEO, and the board supported the development of an extension team. And I was lucky uh, enough, um, I applied for the position and was lucky enough to become um, head, head of that team. And it's been great. We've, I've been in the position for just over 12 months. And um, being a new team, it's, uh, <coughs> it's been great. We've, we've built the team from scratch and uh, we've got obviously new, uh, new staff members in the team and we're starting to, um, to initiate our extension strategy. It's, a, it's an interesting question, how do you describe extension? It, uh, it means many things to, to many different people. To me, what it's all about is working with growers on the ground and identifying the issues um, that are preventing them to, uh, to, to progress in developing um, and growing their, their business. And it's all about identifying the issues and then working together with growers and other, other stakeholders in looking for uh, designing and looking for, for solutions. So the, what I do is I support the extension team and uh, we have six regions. So there's a, a regional extension manager in each of those regions. And I support them in being able to uh, enable uh, initiatives and activities in those regions. So we want a regional presence nationally across Australia and we want to identify those regional needs. We are aiming to work with growers and, and industry stakeholders in looking for solutions for those for those needs. And they might be they might be big solutions that you know that regions um, share you know across across the states nationally, or they might be small smaller issues that you know an individual region has. So what we're working on at the moment are sort of three major things really. Uh, one is that the uh, regional extension managers are developing regional plans that will guide them over the next few years in what's necessary in the regions. Another thing is, is that we're working collectively within the company to work with industry to renew their strategic investment plans. Uh, all of them are coming to an end over the next um, six months. And it's really important that, um, that we cross-check um, you know, the changes that were required for the strategic investment plans with industry. So we're, we're doing a lot of uh, consultations. Um, uh, some of them are face-to-face -face and others are, are on the phone or on Zoom. The other thing that we're doing is we're, we've actually got a couple of new leadership uh, frontier investment initiatives that we're working on at the moment. So watch this space um, because um, there's, there's a couple of exciting things um, from the leadership program that will be coming soon. I think what would be really great in 2021 is to be able to get, get out and about, um, probably like everybody else, uh, really looking forward to, um, to making connections, face-to-face -face connections and being able to realise um, some of the initiatives and priorities that we have in our extension strategy. And again, that's all about you know, identifying, um, identifying issues and working collectively with uh, industries in the regions to find solutions to some of those tricky issues. The team would love to hear from anyone uh, in the regions that, um, that wants to have a chat with us about um, some issues that you're facing or some, some ideas you've got or some innovations that you're thinking about. Um, my contact details and all the other team members' contact details are on our website. Um, so please uh, either give us a call on our mobiles or um, send us an email. <laughs>